we'll see how long the camera stays on the dash. At some point, I will come up with a better way of doing this. There we go. Wedge that there. And this will be my Anthem Update driving video. I haven't really done anything lately for YouTube-based things. I really should just get a mount to stick my camera on the dash. Quality road in Colorado, middle of nowhere. We're gonna go drop off some potatoes. Uh, nothing too exciting. Just out and about today, doing Anthem stuff. Uh, if my phone doesn't fall down, it'd be good. midday time so that way I can actually go and uh, do things. I'm going to help my friend Brian probably uh, repair, do some work on his trailer. Or his RV. Oh, it's an RV, not a trailer. Sorry. My bad. Uh, this is a road. That's definitely a road. out out here where they get bust into town every day to you know cost the taxpayers a bit more money I mean, really I think if you have a job out this far you should be forced to camp out because I mean you know those guys are making like 45 50 bucks an hour they also probably get hotel rooms and stuff like that back on a real road again. It's not packed here. I didn't hit anything. I didn't scrape the trailer. Uh, I don't know what's going on. All right. Stuff and things, guys. Uh, messed my sleep schedule up to get this load. We drove back from uh, Aurora, Colorado to Salt Lake City in one shot. I almost did the whole thing again today, and I'm glad I didn't. Because doing this in the middle of the night would have sucked. I mean, it you know it wouldn't have been much more dangerous, but it just would have been fucking annoying. So I guess it is what it is, and we're gonna see how long it takes us to get through this canyon. I'll probably post this up as one whole video because I still don't know how to edit. I need to like learn how to do that. Colorado, that's... Y'all should be happy if you're getting potatoes. This is the kind of 
stuff we have to deal with. It's not really a road. They've torn everything up. trucking they'll give freight liners a hard time but my little freight liner does pretty darn good yeah I'm gonna have to devise some kind of way to stick myself onto the dash just because I might do some more of these videos there we go I can go all up 17 miles an hour now bouncing along on my all-wheel drive truck I haven't flipped on the all-wheel drive the semis have a way where they lock all of the back axles in the truck and they can get some torque behind them to pull stuff. I've used it a couple of times to get it out of trouble. Uh, there's actually like someone's ranch out here, shockingly. Not really shocking. It's Colorado, it's the middle of nowhere. There's probably more than one ranch out here, just the way it works. It's the thing, it's the way the world is. I don't know. I'm riding my way through these barrels, some of them are pretty close together. I think that road work people are being dolphins. Uh, on the subject, uh, I'm making it. I'm going to make it. I will survive. 